of a photo shoot that we did here in my um, home apartment. Uh, it's really great to just utilize your own space if you can. I uh, got a great team that was there, Heidi. Um, she's a phenomenal like makeup artist and hairstylist. And then we had actually about three models that came from family management here in Vancouver. Um, really great models, great group of girls, um, super awesome to work with. And so today what uh, my goal is to do is to actually just kind of, it's beautiful outside. The sun is finally peeking its head through. Um, so sick and tired of some gray skies. So thank goodness like uh, that the sun is out today and I'm gonna go take advantage of that. So I'm gonna go uh, walk around Granville Island and just kind of mosey on about um, the Granville Island market. There are a lot of cool boutique little shops there and um, there's actually a florist there that I often work with. So I'm gonna take you guys with me for that. I thought I might just quickly like show you guys that um, a lot of times for props I use flowers and I love getting them from Costco because they're like really really good price they're always so beautiful and in luscious bloom as you can see and then here's kind of like a setup that I was doing for a bit of a product flat lay and kind of like incorporating a bit of a fashion image or like a tear sheet from a, from a magazine and this is my one of my all-time favorite skin brands. I absolutely love Tatcha. I love what they represent and how they give back to the community. And these are just little flakes of gold, you'll see. And that is a, an, a, an, an aspect. That is an aspect of one of their products here that has gold little flakes in it. So kind of tailoring back to the product itself and incorporating details from the product in the flat lay around it is something that I like to do often. So just quickly here before we head out, um, this is something that I like to do for the agencies when we've photographed some of their models. We like make a contact sheet that has like a series of images that we think that might be suitable for their portfolio or for their comp cards and we'll put them in a contact sheet that has a, like a nice sprayed layout of the images and then um, with a corresponding number. And it's something, it's an aspect that Photoshop can do for you which is really nice. And then what we'll do is we'll just export the files and we'll send it off to the agency so that they can kind of pick the best, um, the best images that represent their model and so that they can kind of get what is more suitable for their portfolio.
spouting that you guys might hear actually in the background is my um, Instant Pot. I don't know if any of you have this, but this thing is such a godsend when you work three jobs. <laughs> so uh, you just put everything in there and you just let it do it. It's, it's Instant Pot thing. I'm clearly not um, promoted by them by anyways because I don't know how to sell their product. Um, so you, what it is is that you put everything in the, in the base with a little bit of um, water and you could have like even frozen chicken, um, you could put lentils in there, quinoa, I put carrots and uh, carrots and potatoes in there and you just let it pressure cook. So it's, I guess it's a pressure cooker. Um, you just let it pressure cook for a certain period of time, like 10 minutes like at most and it comes out really tender. So highly like that. But anyways, so making some meals for the week and gonna get down to some editing a video, actually the video that you probably previously saw before this one. And um, game plan tonight is to, to do that, go to the gym and try and put on a little bit of self tanner because I'm feeling very peaceful. Hey guys, so it is um, later on in the day now. I've I just made my smoothie, but I decided to change it to my sweater because uh, I'm going to be leaving the balcony door open for take. It's a little warm in here, so uh, I switched into my sweater because it's going to be chilly. So this evening, from the images that I sent over to the agency, they've sent me back a reply in regards to which images they would like me to edit. So that's what I'm going to be working on tonight. I'm going to be editing quite a few of the images and kind of like just showing you a montage of that. If you guys would like me to go into my editing process and show you kind of like what it is that I do, what it is that I see and like tweaking and things like that, let me know in the comments down below. Um, and if you guys want to see any like high resolution detailing um, or anything like that, you can always go and check out my Instagram. Usually things like that will be posted there shortly after these videos kind of like go live, at least a sneak, a sneak peek or something like that. I can hear him. He's somewhere. Where is he? Oh, Tink! He does not like closed doors. So I close these doors kind of like when I'm filming so that it's a nice, clean, crisp background. But Tink does not like them when they're closed and he'll jump up and down on them. <laughs> right, baby? Or not, he knows that I'm watching him right now. Tink! You mad at me? That's you. That's you. Anyways, guys, that's where I'm going to be leaving it off tonight. As always, I um, really appreciate your support. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great night. You better turn up. You better be there when I shake. Watch me rockin' if I can't stop. If I should fall, just go ahead. Go and catch me, baby. Ooh.